Dallas star Jody Sweden was pushed from an embankment down to the concrete ground by an officer with the Los Angeles Police Department while protesting the Supreme Court Roe v. Wade ruling in Los Angeles on Saturday. In a video captured by photographer Michael Aide, the 40-year-old actress appeared to be thrown to the ground while leading a group of peaceful protesters away from the freeway as she gathered with a number of activists in the downtown area of the city. Sweden was seen wearing a black t-shirt and black leggings with a black backpack and a megaphone attached to her arm. At one point in the video, Sweden seemed to be pushed from a dirt hill down to the ground. She skidded across the ground and her hat flew back on her head. A crowd gathered to help her stand up again. One protester could be heard screaming, what the f is wrong with you guys? Another asked, Jody, are you good? Sweden almost immediately stood up again, fixed her hat and joined in the chants with other protesters near the 101 freeway, no justice, no peace. I'm extremely proud of the hundreds of people who showed up yesterday to exercise their First Amendment rights and take immediate action to peacefully protest the giant injustices that have been delivered from our Supreme Court, Sweden told Fox News Digital. Our activism will continue until our voices are heard and action is taken. This will not deter us, we will continue fighting for our rights. We are not free until all of us are free. Fox News Digital contacted the Los Angeles Police Department for comment. Sweden later shared a few words written by Scotty Johns at High Road Saloon on Instagram, which were posted by at SAADIA underscore Mirza. The post said, I said to my wife do you think anyone will commit suicide because they could not get an abortion? She instantly replied yes. Then she added, there will be all those boyfriends and husbands that murder them because they couldn't get one too, and that shook my f ing world. Sweden wrote, true and tragic. She used a hashtag to spell out, you're not pro-life, you're just pro-birth. Sweden is known for playing beloved middle daughter Stephanie Tanner on Full House and the most recent reboot, Fuller House. The decision made by SCOTUS on Friday effectively ended recognition of a constitutional right to abortion which has been in place since 1973, and gives individual states the power to allow, limit or ban the healthcare practice altogether. Supreme Court Justices Samuel Alito, Clarence Thomas, Neil Gorsuch, Amy Coney Barrett, and Brett Kavanaugh voted in favor of ending the landmark federal abortion protection. Chief Justice John Roberts did not approve of ending Roe. The majority has overruled Roe and Casey for one and only one reason, because it has always despised them, and now it has the votes to discard them, wrote Justices Stephen Breyer, Sonia Sotomayor and Elena Kagan in a joint, 59-page dissent. In overruling Roe and Casey, this court betrays its guiding principles. With sorrow, for this court, but more, for the many millions of American women who have today lost a fundamental constitutional protection, we dissent. Tracy Wright is an entertainment writer for Fox News Digital.